You are listening to The Bad Boy Radio Show with Mr. Locario and Miles Cunningham. This is that real shit, not that fake shit. The only radio show that's not afraid to tell you the truth about the game. This is The Bad Boy Radio Show. Remember, the truth is inside you. Money in the chat, he said on Myron's live stream, most of the girls interviewed has said looks do matter. So shout out to Myron. And this is the thing. And let, let me tell you guys something. Some I forgot who it was that said it was somebody. On, I wish I could, could quote the guy's name, but he said something. I, I thought this was profound. I said, this is exactly what it is. I was on a thread and this dude said, and it was this whole topic about looks. He said, you have to look good to get women, but you don't have to be good looking. I was like, that's the, that's the, that's what it is. I said, my nigga said it right there. What I said, that's what I said. Thank you, my nigga. No, that's he, said, he said, you have to look good to get women, but you don't have to be good looking. That's facts. That's exactly what we've been talking about. You understand what I'm saying? So when we're talking about, you know, looks matter and looks don't matter, whatever it is like that. Right. When we talk about you looking good. That means you looking presentable. You understand what I'm saying? You looking fresh. You understand? You got your hair cut. You're smelling good. You got your teeth brushed. You understand? You got clothes that fit. Clothes look good. You smell good. All that other stuff. That's you looking good. You understand what I'm saying? But you don't have to be good looking to get women. You understand what I'm saying? Because dudes look a bunch of different types of ways. You understand what I'm saying? And so this is what this is what dudes don't get. They be thinking they got to be the best looking fucking guy. In order to get chicks, it's like, no, just put your shit together. You understand what I'm saying? That's that's the thing. You feel what I mean? But right. another, but another thing, too, and this is what we talk about excuses, is that that's another excuse. Another excuse is a guy will say, well, I'm not good looking enough. No, no, no. It's not that you're not good looking enough. It's just you ain't got no fucking game. Because if you had game, you know how to make yourself look good. You understand what I'm saying? And then right. you have to do everything else on top of that to make yourself be attractive. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean, and, and and that's a that's a very that's a very important <clears throat> that's a very important quote because again, what guys don't understand about like the you know the comprehension of appearance mm. and looking good as opposed to having good looks, right? Is that looking good is something that you can control. Facts. Having good looks is whatever God gave you, whatever you were born with based on your genetic mix. Right. Your mom and your dad. You understand? So, you know, having 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 looks based on what you cannot control, that's like your height, the shape of your fucking nose, mm-hmm. like, you know, if you're, if you're bald or not. You understand what I'm saying? Right. And shit, with the way things is going today with all of this fucking male weaves and all of this shit, you can, you can change all that too. Right. But the point I'm trying to make is, you, when it comes to looking good, that's something you can control. But the most, what people don't realize about looking good is that it almost has nothing to do with the looks. It's more important that you look good because what happens when you look good based on what you control? What happens is you feel good. Right. Exactly. You understand? And what I mean by that is when you when you when you pick out an outfit. That that you that you you feel comfortable in, and you look in the mirror, and you look, you feel comfortable. See, it's one thing to look good, and then it's another thing to feel comfortable and confident with how with how you look. Facts. You understand what I'm saying? Facts. Like you when you you put on a you put on a shirt that you like, you put on a pair of pants or jeans that you like, the colors that you like. And you like the way it fits because it feels comfortable and it looks good because you like the way it looks. And you look in the mirror and then you say to yourself, I look good. And because I look good, I feel good about how I look. You understand? And that feeling is what gives you the confidence to be able to say, you know, I'm going to go holler at that chick because I see something I like. I feel comfortable right now. I feel good about my appearance. And chances are, that energy will carry through and she'll she'll feel good about my appearance as well. Right. Because when I open my mouth and speak and give off that energy, it's going to 